Hi again. So in this video, I want to show you uh, what a typical week looks like. I'm going to show you week one and week two because we have a couple different different types of assignments in different weeks. So here's the week one. I always have some kind of cartoon or, or image there that, you, that relates to our content that you can take a look at. Then we have our introduction and outcomes. So this is an overview of the week. What we're going to learn about specific learning objectives and the learning activities. These will also be the items listed in our uh, week in D2L. You can uh, look at those. Then the second thing will always be the video lectures and notes. So in week one, we're going to do most weeks. We'll do two sections. There's I think there's one where we do three. Uh, we'll do sections one one to one two. And because we're not meeting, all of the course material um, will be on video. So you'll see all of um, these videos that I've made. And um, there are, um, the number varies per section. One one has two and one two has two, but sometimes there'll be uh, different numbers of videos, some longer, some shorter. And you can see in the video, this is, these are the pages that I'm writing on. Those are the pages in the course packets that you can print or buy, or you can use the Word docs, or you can write on plain paper. But you can see there's a lot of stuff printed on those pages already so that you don't have to write everything down. That will save you time and save your hand from handwriting. Um, so that way you don't have to write all the tables and graphs and all that stuff. Okay, so these are, there are captions, so feel free to turn those on. Um, and also, there's a note here, make sure to make the notes useful for you. You can, um, you know, write most or all of what I'm writing, but also if you want to write something in a different way or add your additional thoughts or um, different colors, highlighting, underlining, all of that stuff. They, the notes should be complete, but they don't need to match mine exactly. And then also some of the sections will have a, a reflection question on the pages. So don't just go by the videos, go by the, the pages themselves and be sure to answer any reflection questions. Okay, so that those are the videos for week one and at the bottom there's also a link to the textbook. I'm gonna like to go back to see the list so I know where I am. So the first thing is always the intro, the second thing is the video lectures, then um, the third thing is going to be my open math online homework. So that is our free online homework system and I have a video about that coming up next. That is so great because it gives you instant feedback. So you get to practice and know that you're doing it right because you get that instant feedback. You also have unlimited tries until you get them all right because it's for learning. Um, okay, so then uh, our assignment in week one is a discussion post, and it's an introduce yourself to your classmates. So, oops, I need to change that to Thursday. Um, it tells you what to put in your post right here. Please include an image that could be of yourself or something about you, something that's important to you, and tell us a little bit about why you chose that image. Include all of these things here. And then please reply to at least two classmates intro posts. Okay, try to spread out replies evenly so everyone has at least one. There's some suggestions for what to write about. Um, you might also have replies if people ask you questions, you might have replies that way too. But please also make two main replies to other classmates posts. Now I won't be commenting very much on these, um, maybe a little bit, maybe not at all. I will read them all. And uh, I like to get to know get to know you that way too. But I'll be writing my comments on your student info paper, so I'll be focusing my my comments there. Okay, so that's our assignment. That's everything for week one. And I want to show you week two also because it has a different type of assignment. So here's our image. <clears throat> the same first three things: introduction and outcomes video lecture and notes, then you do the online homework. And this one has a chapter assignment because we'll be finishing our chapter one in this week. 
So every time we finish a chapter, then there is a chapter assignment. So there are five of those throughout the term. It's roughly every other week, but not quite exactly. So it has um, uh, instructions here, and it also has uh, the Word and the P. So if I click on it, it has a Word and a PDF file. You can click on these files, or you can also use um, the, the pages are printed in the packet. If you printed or bought the packet, you'll have the pages there. So you'll write, write out your assignment on the pages or type it in the Word doc, and then you'll upload it into the assignment folder. One thing that's really important is to upload a single file. So, oops, I didn't mean to edit that. Upload just one file. That way um, I can write, because uh, I will be writing and typing feedback on that document, and um, I can write it and type it all in one document, and you can see it all, okay? So just, um, there's some instructions, there's videos throughout the course resources in here on if you write out the pages, how to scan those all into one document. So be sure to read that or watch that. And then you can also use a Word or Google Doc as well. Okay, pretty much any format that, that works in D12 will read, you can use it. Um, okay, so you can email me with any questions, of course, about any of this. You won't be doing this assignment until week two. Let me go back our contents. Let's see if there's anything else. And that's the end of week two. So that's generally how our class will go. And then you'll just see the weeks go on. We have a midterms, midterm week. So week six will be a little different. We will have a project. I need to update the dates on here. Um, and then down to week 12, which is our finals week. So I hope you, I wish you the best in getting started with with this and if you have any questions at all just reach out to me. I will have a Zoom uh, office hour or student help hour on the first Monday. So every Monday because that's when a lot of things are due. My hours are, let me go back to the home page. I think it's 4 to 5 30. Yeah my hours on Mondays are 4 o'clock to 5 30 p.m. So if you are just getting off work at 5 you can hopefully hop on there. Um, if you have any questions at all, or of course, reach out to me by email and the homework forums that, that I'll explain in my open math. Okay, I really look forward to working with you and I'll see you in the next video.